He's not. He spends the whole time posturing me. Shouting in the chamber. Watch as this man gets aggressive with Woodenville Mayor Mike Millman. Does it seem like he was trying to provoke me in some way? Turns out this guy is the father of city councilwoman Rachel Best Campbell, outraged that council just censured his daughter. Her dad was very aggressive. I'm right in the goddamn f council media. Outside, it escalates far beyond just finger whacking. You're Council member Michelle Evans, capturing the altercation on her phone, explains what happened next. After he was unable to bait the mayor into anything more than just saying, get out of my way, um, he turned on me. Here, can I give you a kiss? You may not hey, touch hey, me. Hey. I'm not touching you. And he put his arms around me and was trying to pull me, and then he yanked my phone out. And Fearful it won't stop here, she just filed a police report. Mayor Millman tells me, meantime, he's rallying those caught up in the saga to discuss safety options. I think it's a shame. I think everybody this morning um, is in shock. The residents of Woodenville deserve better. Excuse me? I said shut up. Council member? Censure me. That might come Do it. based on your behavior. She frequently Randall, speaks over council members who have the floor. The mayor explains he censured council member Bess Campbell for a lack of decorum. Or just saying rude or mean things. Um, you know, I know she calls the mayor names quite frequently because, again, we can all hear it. And because, without council's approval, she scheduled meetings with elected officials in Washington, D.C. At no time did I ever state a position of the city nor claim that my position was that of the city. She's been accused of poking holes in a critical opinion. grant proposal with representatives in both Senator Murray and Representative Del Bene's offices. And we don't all have to agree all the time, but we can agree without being dis disagreeable. It's escalated way beyond what it really should. It's really, it's really become awful. He's down around it. According to the mayor, this isn't the first time that Councilmember Bess Campbell has been censured or has been a point of controversy. He says that last year she was at the center of a harassment suit that cost the city 35,000 taxpayer dollars. I reached out to Councilmember Bess Campbell for comment. We have not heard back yet. Reporting in Woodenville, Lauren Donovan, Fox 13 News.